Okay, so running totals for gravity forms. This is the first of our tutorials and all I have here is Divi set up with gravity forms and it's ready to go. So let's create our first form and it's the running totals form. So I'll call it a website quote form. So that's what we're gonna to create today, a website quote. Enter your details. Okay, let's click create form. And we've got our form started. Now the first thing we need to do is click page. This makes us have a multi-page form. Second thing, we want to make sure that we, let me take that single line out. Um, we're gonna put in the name, email, and phone number of the person that's wanting the quote. Just like that, excellent. Next, we need to put some pricing fields in. So we're gonna put in a product here, and this is gonna be the number of pages. So we're just gonna call this web pages. Just like that. And when, for this example, we're gonna say $100 a page, okay? And I'm gonna duplicate that, and then we're gonna have web forms. And there's gonna be $150 each. Okay, and then I'm gonna put a total in there. And that will then give me the total on that page. Fantastic. Let's duplicate and make another page and drag these up here because we've made another page. And now on the next page, I'm going to have a product. And this one is going to be SEO setup. Um, and this time though, what I'm going to do is change it a little bit. We're not going to do a single product anymore. We're actually going to have radio buttons. And in this case, we're gonna say Yoast, and we'll say that's 150 to set up, all in one SEO, and we're gonna put 150 on that too, or we're gonna say no thanks, and that's zero. And we'll set that to be the default by clicking in the radio there. Then we're going to say uh, Google Analytics, and we're just gonna say yes there, and no thanks down there, that's great. So these are some different options, obviously. And next up, we're going to have MailChimp integration. Just like that. And then we have yes and no thanks once again. Okay, that's fantastic. Now we're gonna make another page. And again, what I've gotta do is drag these up into this page here, right? Just like that, cool. Okay, uh, last page, we're going to now add in some more yes and no. So I'm gonna duplicate the MailChimp just to save me typing a little bit to get through this tutorial quickly. And it's probably the way I'd do it anyway. So we click on the down arrow there. And now we're gonna say uh, e-commerce. Um, we're gonna say WooCommerce is an option. And we'll put that in at 1150. And I'm gonna add another one here, which would be just a payment form. It's kind of like a gravity form, you know, where you do something like that. We're gonna put that at 450. And then the other thing I'm gonna do is add in some other types of options, right? Uh, quite often we have things like a FAQ setup, right? Something like that. Uh, this one's gonna be 150, yes, like that. Wonderful. Um, that's all fantastic. So we're gonna we've got the FAQ set up, and the final one, of course, one of the important ones, a blog set up. So I put that down there, just like that. Great. Now we've got all our items there, and I'm going to add in some total fields. So I just click total, drag that there, click it again, add it there, and that's pretty much it. So I click update. Now what I've done is added the total to a number of different pages. So now when I click preview, now I haven't added anything in here, but I'll just go that. And we'll put in my uh, MRK, click next. Uh, one there, one there. See how it's added it straight away if I change that to 10. I've got my totals there. I want three forms. You see? And then I click next. I say I want Yoast. It adds it to the total. Yes, yes, see how it's adding it in, or no thanks. And the totals are changing, which is fantastic. Next, and then I'm one of them, WooCommerce, yes, and yes, and you can see how the total is all adding up at the bottom. This is really great for doing your quote forms. So this is the simple way that you add in a running total to a gravity form.
Thank <laughs> you.